Hey guys, Mike Berlin with Slam Car Wash Marketing, joined by Nick Kearns from Sunny's Controls, here to bring you six ideas to help you boost sales at your car wash. We decided to tag team this one because controls and marketing work hand in hand. There's a ton of data that you get from your POS and some killer features to help you get your messaging out to the consumer. At the center of it all is your customer database. Let's take a look. Number one, texting. LPR data tells us that 75% of our customers visit us less than three times a year. 58% only come once a year. So texting is a direct communication link to your customers. It's an extremely powerful way to communicate with them and encourage them to come back more often. People talk a lot about email marketing. I'm not saying email is dead, but most of us would agree that when we get a text, we still actually look at it and read it. Text marketing has gotten very easy with Sonny's controls. Nick, how do we get the phone number from these customers and how do we send them text? Mike, that leads us to number two, the loyalty program. We can prompt a customer when they pull up to the pay station to join a loyalty program and earn points towards a free wash. This is all built into our back office software where you can assign different point values to different wash purchases and also determine how many points need to be earned to receive a free wash. Asking customers to enter a phone number at the pay station doesn't mean you have to have a loyalty program. We can simply prompt the customer to join our text club to receive deals and coupons via text. This also works for a lot of operators. Once we have a database of phone numbers, we can send text to non-members and give them deals and incentives to come join an unlimited plan or get some type of discounted purchase. We designed it to be easy and fast enough so that an operator can send out messages on the fly. For example, Say it's an overcast Saturday, so you send a text to all non-members that has a unique one-time use code worth $5 off of any wash purchase. You can do that in minutes right from the back office. You can also send text automatically when a club plan is purchased, for example. As a customer is riding through the tunnel, they get a text that thanks them for joining the membership and also has a link to activate their membership online, which prompts them to install your app. No need for additional staff or equipment. The pay station takes care of everything and your customers can manage their account anytime. Number three, retargeting. When we advertise online and promote an unlimited plan, we typically cast a net to a five mile radius of your wash. We track to see who engages with the ad, then we put them into a different bucket and we start advertising to that smaller audience of warmer leads. Only this time the ad's a little more direct since we know they've already seen the previous ad. Now with phone numbers captured at the pay station, we can pull a list of customers that are not members and send them ads as a custom audience. These are people that I know have been to our car wash but aren't yet unlimited members. Not only that, but we can take a list of members and make sure they're excluded so that we're not wasting money advertising the people that are already members. Having my customer database in the POS and having phone numbers really helps us remarket to customers effectively. Okay, number four is fundraising. Our fundraising program has been increasing in popularity. Operators that have tried a fundraiser program typically do it more than once. Essentially, we built out a program where you give a group, like a local church, a universal code. When that code comes back to us at the pay station, we track it and let's say that we're gonna give the group $2 per transaction. We turn those local groups into sales agents for us and we make it fun and easy for them to raise money for their group. We run a campaign for six months. At the end, we print out the report of all the transactions, the total sales and the donation percentage, and then cut a check. Nick, and then we can have them come take a picture receiving that big giant check and post it to social media. You can build it up to have every church group, scout troop, band or athletic team running around promoting your wash. Number five, a smart digital ad campaign. A very powerful way to boost sales is to advertise. But how do you know what your return on the investment is? Again, we lean on Sunny's controls. We launch our ads on places like Google, Bing, Yelp, Facebook, Instagram, Nextdoor. We promote a deal with a button to click the deal. They click, they go to a landing page where we present them the code. They take that QR code, numeric code, barcode, whatever, and bring it back to our pay station. We track how many times that code gets redeemed back at the pay station. Each code is unique to the ad. This way we know which ad platform performs the best and we can calculate the ROI. Now there's a whole lot more to it than that, but running ad campaigns online with a trackable code that loop back to the POS is a great way to boost sales. 
When you are running a promotion for a single wash, for example, $5 off of your new $25 package, you want to use one-time use codes for that. This way, people can't share the code and abuse it. When we're talking about running a promotion for an unlimited plan, you can use a universal code, which will give you a discount on one of the memberships you offer. You can create those codes right in the back office in just a few clicks. Number six is sales commission tracking. Teaching your team how to sell at the pay station in a comfortable, authentic way is very important. If we add a commission bonus to that, how do we track it and make it easy to report each month to our crew? Let's say we want to give $2 every time one of our employees sells an unlimited membership at the pay station. Nick, how do we manage that? The sales commission system utilizes barcodes. Each employee has their own barcode that you can print on a card or a badge that they can have on their person. When an attendant is manning a pay station and makes a membership sale, they scan their barcode, which tells your back office reporting that this employee sold this membership at this time. Then simply run a report for these commissions and submit to payroll. I hope we've given you some new ideas on how to boost sales at your wash. If you need help, you can call Nick or myself anytime. The crew at Slam and Car Wash Controls love helping customers boost sales, and our mission is to make it easy. Thanks for watching.